Welcome back. Nick and Lex here. Hello, everyone. How's it going, everyone? So tonight. Woo! <laughs> we actually had to rehearse that because I just do it very naturally. And uh, But we do have a cup. If you like that whole intro. And then I was like, how does it go? Because I never think about it. Yeah. You know? So, yeah. Yeah, so to, I always, I, I, I actually clap a lot. You do. So tonight, um, we're going to do a song from yes. Mark. Yes, Mark Alexander. Mark he Alexander. is the raffle winner for the um, La Familia raffle on Patreon. So thank you very much, Mark. Congratulations. And we're very happy to do this song for you. Uh, I feel like you choose a lot of Devin Townsend, and this <laughs> yeah. is not um, an exception. Devin Townsend Project... It's mm -hmm. going to be From the Heart okay. song. Yes, we've done some Devin Townsend, uh, mostly for Mark Alexander. And then uh, he also sent us the collection, I think. Mm -hmm. And um, he showed us his collection. So he is a real fan. So I'm really, ha really happy to be able to do this. And also, um, uh, yeah, check out if you're a winner in the last video that Alexia posted. Because, um, yeah. It's important. Yes. Um, all right. Well, when is this from 2016? Yes. I see. So not as old. No. You know. Fairly recent from the album Transcendence. I really like the album cover and I'm pulling it up. It looks like he has something in his lap just like this little angel. <laughs> yes. And he's sitting like this. So I can sit it's like this. It's a sheep, right? <laughs> it's a sheep. Like a lamb. A I lamb. Think. Yeah. Yeah. So I'm um, I'm excited about this. I know that every time we've done uh, Devin Townsend, it's always good, yeah, yeah. you know. Um, and you've done some, and we've done some together, and now here we are. Here we are. Thank you, All Mark. Right. Yeah. Well, I'm super ready. I don't know what to expect. Um, you know, uh, that's what I like about Devin that it's always a little bit different. Yes. His music yes. is very versatile. So mm -hmm. let's see what we get. If we get like death metal, if we get very um ethereal yes you know mm -hmm. music or straight up rock i don't know so let's uh I'm um, excited. if you're a fan please give the video a like maybe subscribe to the channel we should add, actually add that thing again you know yes let's do it this the, time. that graphic mm -hmm. that would be fun i agree all right here we go thank you so much thank and you. enjoy here we go
Okay. <laughs> very nice. Very nice. What did you think? Uh, I I like I I think I like the um I'm sorry. No, no, no. <laughs> the good. third part the best. Yeah. Because the first part was just like I'm not like I don't know like his voice is okay mm -hmm. but he does different voices he, he does. does like yes very high very like falsetto mm -hmm. i like him and this was just the voice that he wanted to do very like like scream uh, no not even screaming but it was like you know that kind of <laughs> okay and just the guitars right i don't like gent Okay. I don't like the seven string okay. tuning. Okay. I, I just haven't gotten used to it. And that's, I think, going on there a lot. Mm -hmm. gin, 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 gin. Yeah. Like, I, even though I love metal, it's just like, I don't know. But it was good. I mean, you have to give it to him. It was good. <laughs> yeah. And, uh, but it's just like my, not my style because it's very slow, but it's very heavy. It's very thick. Mm -hmm. uh, but then I like that middle section. It was almost, I think, like Hare Krishna. Yeah. Right? I know. Was it? it? Yep. So that was cool. But then the last section, when it got more into the guitar chords. Mm -hmm. I liked when guitar. he was doing that distortion, yeah. very light. Yeah. Because at the beginning it was very... Yeah. I don't know. And even though I love that kind of music, maybe I just don't like it when it's so slow and with lyrics that are... And the lyrics are very nice. That, about Mark love said it was a very like um one of his favorite love songs so there you yeah go. the lyrics so, were beautiful yeah the lyrics are very cool just the the way it's the music is just like mm -hmm. maybe i haven't experienced this music enough but i'm not saying it's i don't like it but mm -hmm. it's just like the 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 last part even reminded me of marty friedman mm -hmm. um his solo stuff it's instrumental but it's very oriental and uh just the scales he uses are very like um there's a lot of um the word <laughs> there's a lot of scales that are very i'll, I'll come back to okay me. but yeah you go um, i what did you think the I, whole thing yes totally um it's not i don't know that i would listen to this song as much because of the first section mm. it's not entirely my like cup of tea but the second and third i really <laughs> enjoyed i really really did because and but yeah. as a whole i like that i like that it has those differences you know mm -hmm. and yeah. it's very neat how he went from such heavy distortion on the guitar to very simple like clean mm -hmm. on, yeah. on those parts I and love that too the yeah. keyboards it was more like keyboards totally. with some chords yes. and nice like lead guitar but very clean and very like spiritual yeah but the whole thing sounded very ethereal, ethereal. the first section mm -hmm. ethereal the first section maybe more like metal you know like it's i don't know what it's called i think um they call it like I have no idea. I'm just going to mess up because it's just, it is what it is. But you know, this musician is, has a lot of styles. So very diverse, that's what yeah. is so cool that maybe this song is just the way it is. And then the next song is going to be completely different. He was the singer on one of Steve Vai's album. Mm, very interesting. Okay. Um, and I've heard some other stuff that we've done. I think also from Mark that I enjoyed a mm -hmm. little bit more because mm -hmm. it was more down my alley. It was a little prog here. Mm -hmm and stuff like that but i mean overall it's good music it's just like that my music yeah i wouldn't put this on to read a book mm -hmm, you know mm -hmm. maybe the last part you know but that i could rather listen to marty friedman you yes know? yes um because i like that um uh that you're still <laughs> yeah i'm still word. looking for that word it is obviously now i'm very curious exotic is, oh that's what i wanted exotic. to say he does exotic he uses exotic scales uh -huh, that are uh -huh. not being used okay in western music that much so when he does it it sounds very cool because he's using all that you know japanese he lives in japan ah. right and even but even when he was in megadeth his solos are very exotic sounding 
very different because he was already using those mm -hmm. scales that are exotic. Exotic. And uh, that gives it a whole different, you know, vibe instead of playing a blue scale like in a Metallica solo, mm -hmm. you know. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. yeah. But yeah, overall, very cool, very interesting. I'm just like not ready you know, I need to listen. It's to okay. More. It's totally fine. Mm -hmm. I agree. I think it was a great request because it does highlight the diversity of yeah. Devin. Yeah, and I you no, know what I like is that it's different. I really, I had the lyrics pulled up. So yeah, yeah, yeah. What I those. like about this artist that is it's not the same old, same old. You mm -hmm. know, it's uh, it's it's great for a reaction because yeah. it's different. But I. First, I was just like wondering, like, wow, okay, because it is also a lengthier song, and it was the most amount of time on that. Yeah, I don't remember really the uh, <laughs> the riff, but but very interesting. Yeah, yeah, I really enjoyed it um, because it was different. But I don't know that I will, like I said, just play this. If it was only like the second and third parts, I would be like, oh my gosh, I, I could listen to it's this like all day. But it is like we put on at night to sleep. <laughs> yeah, it, exactly. Yeah, it is very on the heavier side for me. And that's why I would probably just be like, OK, you know, like, I don't know. Uh, but thank you so much, Mark. Thank you, everyone, so much. Let us know your thoughts. Um, if you're a big Devin Townsend Project uh, fan and you're wondering what we're talking about or why, you know, let us know your uh, side. We love to hear from you guys, any trivia that you know. If this was your first time listening to this track, uh, also please share your thoughts. Thank you everyone so much. If you like the video at any point, uh, please hit that like button, subscribe. We would love to see you all in the next one. Thank Bye you. everyone. Bye.